What is up you guys? It's Taylor. And Jeff. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today, we're doing another daily vlog, which is a bunch of random stuff that we do. Today, we are going to go to our favorite nursery and get some plants that didn't make it through the winter. And we have some spots to fill in that we didn't do last year. Yeah, so when we rebuilt our deck, watch that video here. Unfortunately, some of our lavender, which borders the deck, got trampled. So we need to replace it, which is no big deal, but today's gonna be nice, so we're gonna do that. Yeah, I wanna also walk to our local town nursery. Mm -hmm. Check out the inventory. I'm gonna go to the gym, because that's how I start my day every day. Something fun, we just got our saliva collection kit for our genetic testing for our possible IVF journey in the future. Just want to reiterate that that is not happening right now, but it's always nice to check your genetics. But yeah, let's go to the gym. All right, guys, I just finished my workout. Here's a good one. So I got a smoothie. It's 11.02, so Jeff is in a meeting. There's actually a Home Depot right by our gym out here. So I'm gonna run by there and see if they have any good plants before we go to the nursery, because I guarantee you the nursery is gonna be much more expensive. So let's go to Home Depot and see if they have any good plants that we can get. All right, so they have lavender, but I guarantee you Jeff is gonna want like massive lavender, but I need to take a picture of this and send it to him and see what he thinks. I also don't think this is the same lavender that we have, so maybe not. Oh, look at all the herbs and tomatoes. Can't wait to plant these next weekend. Maybe we'll plant some blueberries in the garden this year. These are like a shrub though. I wonder if that's, if we don't have enough space. So there was definitely some options, but I'm not gonna buy anything without Jeff because uh, I want to include him. But I'm gonna head back to the house now. There's actually an area, there's actually an area in the backyard that gets only afternoon sun. And it's like this big patch of open dirt that I was thinking maybe we could plant some hostas in and do like a little hosta garden and like some, maybe a few pieces of like lavender or something, I don't know. Anyway, let's go home and see Jeff and see if he's ready. All right, so here's this area right here that we kind of don't know what to do with. So I'm thinking maybe we do the hosta garden here. Here's the lavender we planted last year. It's kind of not looking great. Hello. We are on our way to the nursery. We're gonna see what they got. We have our uh, shopping list, but we know that we always end up with more. It's like the grocery store where you like pick out snacks. Yeah. Except these snacks are very expensive and you have to take care of them. Right, good comparison. Um, like, I know I'm going to see a strawberry plant and be like, let's try to grow strawberries. I saw, I recorded earlier at Home Depot a blueberry bush, but I, I think those are too big, right? I think they get very bushy, yes. Yeah. Okay, well, we're a few minutes away. Stay tuned. All right, give us the tea. Okay, they're delivering today. It was Delivery was $24, that's which is such, great because we would such a steal. not have fit that in the car. No, I think one of the, two of the things we got are like six feet tall. Okay, here's what I'm nervous about. We bought two like six foot vine things that we don't really know what they are because they haven't bud yet. They're trumpet honeysuckle honeysuckle vine they didn't have a tag and we don't know what color the flowers are going to be it could be either orange yellow or red it'll be very exciting once they do bloom the make sure you follow us now so you can <laughs> figure out what color the flowers are i love honeysuckle but we didn't get like the classic yellow honeysuckle yet we still might because we're doing this around our deck where we're going to be sitting most of the time and having dinners or where we outdoor dine what's that called Al fresco? I almost said al dente. That's pasta. Yeah. Anyway, so we don't want like a ton of bees, 
But then I was thinking, our entire deck is surrounded by lavender. That attracts bees, and I didn't I didn't notice one thing last year. Anyway, they're delivering today, so let's go home. Quick pit stop before we go home. We're gonna stop at our local Home Depot because I need to pick up some more rocks. If you watched our last video uh, for the garden, so I'm going to Home Depot because that's where I got them last time. I don't know if Lowe's has the exact same one, so we're gonna do that. And then we're picking up lunch. Thank God. One more stop. Wow, that was pretty cool. Phoebe says good job. Maybe Phoebe could help. Or I'm holding pay the bills or I'm, something. I'm holding Phoebe. I can't help. Phoebe just cooks. Phoebe just cooks. Sounds like someone else I know. I just want to point. I feel like it's a great, accurate representation of our relationship. Look at, the, look at. So this is all mine, and this is Jeff, and this is all he carried. Excuse me. She has a name. This is all he carried. Her name is Phoebe, and she appreciates if you address her as. You got it. The lady inside saw me pushing this cart and saw Jeff carrying the mint and said, he's pushing that cart and you're carrying that plant. You feel stupid? I said, nope, I feel lucky. All right, now let's go pick up lunch. Damn. Not for you. Two good things. One, we just ordered an entryway table from Pottery Barn, which we're very excited about. So that's been done. And the flowers just arrived. All right, let's go unload those. Right, so here's our delivery. Got a bunch of stuff. Gonna plant these. Maybe some of them today, maybe some of them tomorrow. But yay, we got some new plants. So I think we're gonna do all of these like fun purple, butterfly-ish plants over there next to the bedroom. So I'm gonna go lay those down now, see what they kind of look like. I need to plant them and make them look nice, but I'm excited about this new little area. Come with me. We got these, what we think are trumpet Honeysuckles. I liked them because they were big and mature. We we're gonna put one in the corner over there and then one in the corner over here. And then if you want to do the arch in the middle, let's get the regular honeysuckle. These hydrangeas are really popping back here. Guys, this is gonna be all mulch, so don't judge right now. They could also look cute in pots yeah, here. Yeah, but let's get different ones for that. Come on, Yeah. This. Yeah, do three there. Three, and then same thing over there. Or unless, are we gonna do the grill there or no? I don't know where else we're gonna put it. I think we're either putting the grill there or on this side. Took it out of its little home. Gonna loosen up the roots so it learns to spread out a bit. here now we're gonna fill it in All right, 
a year later, we finally got the garden gravel finished. It looks so much better. Um, I gotta get rid of all this trash out there, but that looks so much nicer and so much more put together. Picked out all the weeds, so I need to pick those out of the garden. And then next week we get to plant everything actually in the garden. I think that's it. Thanks for watching. Leave us a comment. Subscribe to our channel. We'll see you next week with uh, more planting, right? Yeah. Great. All right, goodbye. Bye.